Hey guys, real here. Welcome back to my Final Fantasy XII Let's Play. This is part... I actually don't know. Part 4? Yeah, I think it's part 4. Um, so I got the Karkata. Uh, after I got the Karkata, I went and stole from the other mob on the screen. Uh, I'll show it off next time. And um, I got a bronze shield from it. So not really lucky i think he's got a better shield and he's also got gauntlets which i forget what they do um we do kind of need to work on my equipment but before we do that let's go finish up this hunt Boop -ba -doo. yeah we'll be rocking times two i think for a lot of this might as well it's here it's featured and this is when it's really sandy Yes. Actually, you know what we really should do? Thank you. Hi. I don't know if we'll worry about getting the Gladys or not. We might as well, because we're going to be killing a lot of wolves just for the fact that you know, they're in my way. Yes. Slash, we're having to for this hunt. Is he? He's supposed to be here. Right. Oh, I picked up the hunt, but I never talked to the person. Never mind. Actually, let's go do that now. As long as we don't hit the save crystal, I think our combo stays the same, or the chain, or whatever. Oh, I don't know why. For some reason, I thought we were going to speed up. <laughs> Alright, let's check the clan primer. Under hunts. We need to go talk to Gatsley, which is, um, I think he's the tavern owner. The question is, do we have the Moogle teleports yet? I think you're trying to sell me a chocobo, right? No thanks. No, it's, um, I think you say here for the teleport, I don't remember. It'll be a little bit for us to get that, I guess because I'm spending so much time in the first section of the game. <laughs> the very first section. Uh, okay, where am I heading? I'm heading to the tavern. Okay, I guess we could also turn in Rogue Tomato. Also, we could have gotten a few things from trial mode. Um, whether or not we're wearing a diamond armlet or not. Diamond armlet will mostly get us um, a few techniques and magic spells, I think. So we'll go through as far as we can once we get our party going. Uh, trial mode. And, um... Was he the first guy? No. Tamaj was the first guy to give it to us. Okay, there we go. Rogue Tomato is done. And I think he gives us a... Oh, teleport zone. I thought it was a bangle. Oh no, maybe he does that before the hunt. Okay, where is... Maybe he's not who I thought he was. Oh, right. It's this dude. Oops. Everything in this is, like, points at the negative first, so I assumed I had to go out of the way. Okay. So we already saw him, and I beat him with a dagger, so now, uh, now he should die real easy. I still have to steal another one of these. Uh, I just didn't want to do it again. I should have actually done it off video right away. Oh well, we might not even have a full party yet. Maybe I'll do it off video after this one. Bum, bum, bum. Which way do I go? I've already forgotten. Wester Sands, right? Yeah. I remember 
for this chest in uh, the regular game had a chance to get a really powerful uh, moat. Moat or basically single use spells. Um, it's an item. We got a bubble moat from from um, the trial mode earlier. Bubble is a spell that doubles your maximum health. Uh, and it lasts a little while. It's super helpful. Um, not as a moat, but as a spell. But I guess it could be super helpful. And apparently that has a chance to drop Phoenix down. So if you're really low on cash, you could be farming wolves while picking up chests. And uh, make sure you pick up that one. I like this map because I think there's only wolves in it. The next map we're gonna have to hunt wolves and we'll have to avoid killing other things. That's the problem with a lot of these chests, even if they have good items, most of the time they'll just give you a kill. So this is where we'll be fighting uh, the Lindbergh, Lindbergh yes. Wolf, I think that's his name. Uh, but we need a combo of 20 before he'll spawn. Oh, there's a chest on the screen I forgot about. Yeah, I'm never moving we'll back. Also, cactus is spawn, but they're not aggressive, so never really have an issue with that. Okay, we're gonna swing left here. Just because I know now we're a double transition away, we've respawned all the wolves, but I also knew there was two wolves here. Yes! I'm trying to remember if helmets in this game only deal with magic resistance and the zero armor you care about or not. I can't remember. I think it is actually. I could figure it out pretty quick actually. Let's see here. Magic resistance? Defense. Yeah, okay, so that is how it works. So we'll get a good helmet just because I know what it is. But I'm not sure where we're gonna get armor. Probably from trial mode. I thought that auto ran for you, I guess not. has the Gladys, but it's a hard steal, so... It's much better to do this with a lot of people, because a lot of this attacks do a lot of damage, so...
Excuse me. The problem is I can get the uh, the traveler's vestments, the bazaar, and that doesn't really help a lot. There's a really good um, steel, but it's not for heavy armor, it's for light armor. It's called a uh, chainmail. Uh, there's even a decent one called a windbreaker. Both steal it from werewolves. I'm just taking a look. You can get a bronze helmet. Oops. You can get a bronze helmet, which I think you can probably buy. You might not be able to, but bronze helmet from an item box. I don't know if we could even sell all this stuff though, because they just show a lot of damage right now. It's not really that good. Let me see here. So we can get bronze armor from um, from the seventh. Oh, they have Viking coats. Those are good light armor um, from tier eight or trial eight. They have a golden shield and a flame shield. Dang. Okay, well, we're not gonna do much on trial ten. That's not really a good way to get armor. Um, what do we have here? Well, buying stuff is out of the question. Um, we have a decent amount of health. Actually, I should be doing license points. That should give us at least more damage. Or more health. Let's see, I could do more damage. Okay, let's take a look. Maybe if I recognize the name. Um... I know we can... Oh, wait. I said chain mail for some reason. Oh, okay. So the trial I died on, we could get chain mail from. And that'll be our armor for now. I think that is trial uh, level 5. Yeah, it is chain mail. Okay. Well, we'll go get the winged helmet at least. And uh, then we'll unlock this. But for now, let's grab some health. Um, battle lore, battle lore. Gain MP after taking damage, that'll be helpful for later. Dang, that was a lot of health for that early of a one. Um... Oh, a swiftness, that would be helpful, but it's a lot of battle war stuff around there. Might as well be doing some battle lore stuff. Probably will do my red spiral here so I can get the 390. Excalibur and Reviver, meh. Telekinesis is super helpful, but we'll figure out how to get that later. You know what, let's start pumping some battle wars to give us some more damage. Actually, I'll just do all of these passives. Oh, I don't even have much. Okay, let's go and try to farm a winged helmet. Um, try to farm two, just because um, they're for farming the green jellies. Is it west? I, I don't know what's with me today. Actually, even just lately. I always used to, I think I'm thinking about it now, I always used to get these mixed up west and east. They're just too similar. Never had that issue with Giza Plains, obviously. Oh, I could have turned in uh, the other hunt as well. Man, why does it always have to be such bad weather? Yes. Oh, 
There was an undead guy who spawns around here. I can't remember what he drops. Yes. I think it was an axe in the right game. I don't think there was anything useful from this game. Can't wait knowledge of this game. It's been so long since I played it. That was helpful. solo for a while, I'll have really good armor, but I don't have access to really good armor right now, although I could have done trial mode and went for it. I didn't realize chainmail was uh, for fun, although I think I died on that trial, so we would have to struggle. we need to get the steel pretty early. Slash, I would have needed to not be done the Karakata. Okay, there's a lot of traps in here, and I don't remember exactly where they are, and I don't have Libra to find them. Yeah. So, these are the green jellies. I can't remember what they're actually called. Okay, so there's traps on one of these corners. I can't remember if it's the left or right. I think it's the right side. So we got the trap there for next time, hopefully. 
such a big part of it, which is healing solo, because I can't get here with the uh, with the knight, I think. Yes. We're gonna die. Please hit. God, we are gonna die. <coughs> oh, you yes. cheater. We're dead. There's nothing I can do. idea <clears throat> without a better armor we shouldn't be soloing so let's try to do trial mode and we'll try to get a chain mail uh, we'll see how well it goes anyways Shield from you just walk over here and he spawns. He 
has a really good shield. Oh, not a really good shield, but a better shield. Okay, I don't think there was anything super good about this place. some items around I think there was like a remedy and something. Alright. So this is the guy we are going to steal the chainmail from later. Oh my god, we got the windbreaker. Which would be a really decent armor if we could wear light armor. But the Viking coat we can get later is better. Excuse me, getting a team going. Alright, now we need to get out of here without dying. And I left myself with very little health. Oh, we could potion if we wanted. Let's just zoom, zoom out of here. Investments we can get solo with even our crap armor easy, uh, but that doesn't benefit us as a solo person, anyways. So we'll, uh, we'll scratch our idea and we'll go to let's get another, let's get a team going. We'll go for two car caught up we have Bosch. for half hour, okay. Because we've done so much, like, the dusty and stuff. Or when did we start this recording? You know what, I've already forgotten. I've forgotten what we've done in this one. <laughs> okay, let's see here. We want... The reason I like to do solo more for finding, like, jellies and stuff... Um, I forgot what point we're at. Right, we gotta go meet down. Um... The reason I like doing that is because you have so much less need for control. Um, you don't have an issue of your teammates accidentally going and killing the frog, for instance, and stopping your combo. Did we, we must have touched this one already. Right? I can't. Let's check our teleport list. It's really this in the fortress, okay? That's fine by me. Usually I get all the Ravenaster ones first, so that the fortress will be like the fourth one, because there's one really far in the Wester Sands, there's one far in the Ester Sands. Alright, so there's a certain point in this uh, early section where it warns us that if we go any farther we can't come back. Now you'll um, be wanting to know- We're definitely way overpowered to need to come back. Um, but it's pretty much right here, once we grab this and sneak our way into the castle, that's when we're stuck, and we have to, um, we have to keep going. I didn't know this was part of it. I forgot all about that. That's Vossler. We'll run into him later. Um, but yes, we need to go 
where we've killed the rats at the first point of the game. There's a chest around here. I just don't remember why I need the group of fish. Mm -hmm. There's chests all over the place here. They're not very worth it, but we're pretty broke. So that little uh, diamond symbol there is um, for gambits. We can't go in there, we can't learn anything until we get the gambit system unlocked, which is pretty much just a few seconds away in, uh, not a few seconds, probably a few minutes away in uh, the main story that we've been avoiding. So we can also, this changing the license board resets your license board progress for whatever character you want, and that way they can repick their job classes. So we have nothing for him, uh, now let's go to the tavern, because I think there should be a ghost or something. I should be on top of this more often, but we haven't even given in um, this thing. We should have, because now I can buy another monograph, right? And now he's gone. I think he's somewhere else now. Oh, we'll need to do this. Uh, we can do it later, though. So we need to do that in order to do an actual side quest later in the game. Um, I just want to go to a shop so I can buy the bazaar. And then we'll be broke again. Not broke, but we'll be at 30k. Oh, it's not there anymore. I gotta look up the, the hunting um, monogram. I thought that's all we had to do. Am I still looking for the monograms? I don't know. There's not why would I? I thought we were done. Okay. F12 monographs. Or something else. Apparently that wasn't what it was supposed to be. Let's do a different website this time. Hunter's monograph. Talk to Ghast. The after completing the wolf hunt enables the acquisition. Okay. So we need to talk to him, but I don't know where he went because I think he's somewhere else now. We'll have to talk to him before we ever see him. Tavern and look, but I'm pretty sure he disappeared. And that means he moved somewhere else. I definitely remember talking to him again later, but not here. I thought it was during another. at the soft and like he was like hate the uh the anti um, petrifying magic uh, soft I was like well, that's a weird app I have on somebody I don't know where he is so we'll run into him later I'm sure. Oh he's down here. We could go do the flower cactus by ourselves easy. We beat him in the trial three doesn't have as much backup, so... 
actually easier in the main game. It's actually true for a lot of the hunts. Oh, Kites gave us the key. I thought for some reason I messed it up. So there's two different entrances. I think one of them's closed. And the other one is open. I think the other one's closed for a hunt. And not 100% though. No, the other one's closed till we do this main story part, actually. As we loop around, we're in a section we haven't been in yet. This is not where we fought the rats. Yeah, perfect. Okay, so this isn't the point of no return yet. There will be like a warning, and then every time you try to save after that point, it'll tell you. Don't forget, you can't get back and you can't do this. I thought it was really nice that they had that warning. Yeah. Notice how, like, I'm now fighting rats again, back to the main story, which is way easier than the other ones. So yeah, all these treasure chests and stuff is probably worse than we had access. Hmm, probably very little point too far. Yeah. Well, XP, okay. Jellies were doing like a thousand. I think the wolves were doing about this thing. Yes! Lots of little areas you can find chests here, but I still don't think any of these chests are worth it, so... Oh! This is a rare game that we fought in the trial. I didn't know it was going to spawn. I don't know if that's rare or not. I've never actually fought him in the game. I normally also don't attack the fish, so that's probably what happened. Okay, so this is the point of no return. Doesn't tell you, I thought it told you. No, oh, here you go. It won't be easy getting out. Am I ready for this? So that's their warning, and then they have an, an actual, like, yellow or orange. I can't, I think it's orange. Warning every time I go to save that it's like there's, there's a point of no return. Not that they actually use those words, but that's the meaning behind it. Ooh, I totally forgot about these. <clears throat> These giant little green jugs will fill up your whole map. I don't know if there's a thing about needing to fill up the maps or not. I don't remember. Boing! Thank you. So, a lot of these are in areas you can never get back to. So, now that we have the whole map, we don't have to go back here. I think there must be like an achievement or something. So this orange text pops up. We won't easily be able to get out. But I don't care because I'm not worried about it. Because I can do, I, I can and I have done it at level 1 with getting no gear or anything. Because I wanted to test the max health of characters and stuff. And here was another spot where you would, uh, ruin your zodiac spear if you were picking up these so people would avoid all the chests in here. Oh, I thought you could open that. That looks will be super helpful at some point. Probably not. I'll probably never use it. And here becomes the, uh, the story of Hay Buckethead. 
Oh, there's lots of stupid things in this game um, that Vaughn has to do. Well, I guess he wants to do, but yeah. You know, this is one of them. Oh, it's this dude. Okay, so if you walk too close, the guard gets mad at you. And then now we've got to talk to somebody. I think it's this dude. I forget what the race there are seeks. Uh, it's like S E E Q, I think. So now he's gonna help us by telling us we can call the guard. Hey, Buckethead! And uh, Vaughn's favorite line Hey, Buckethead. Okay, for some reason you can walk by the guard, he doesn't care. I thought you had to go around so he didn't notice you. Okay, now I need to remember how this works. We use the hey bucket head to move guards around a bit. Over here! This guy. I might have actually just screwed myself. Yeah, I did. <laughs> yep, I did the wrong one. I did the wrong order of doing that. And I blocked myself. Okay, sorry. I'm supposed to figure out if this isn't the right signet. We have to go to this side. Oh, I could have showed it here when I'm doing Hello? Okay, is this the right one? I don't think so. Oh, maybe. Yeah, so we need to go to here to light this up. something here, to be honest. Hello? <laughs> I was trying to sneak by. <laughs> okay, there's something I'm missing here. Can I go over here? Over here? No, okay. So I do have to go past that. So I think I call these guys and these guys and then try to run. Hey, Buckethead! This guy first. Over here! Which didn't work. Hello? Then we'll call these. Hey, Buckethead! Then we'll call these guys. This was Over one. here! I was thinking, I don't know. I trap myself so easily there. <sighs> Is it this one? No. I honestly never struggled like that. Um, but normally I think I thought you could double up two of them and get them stuck and make it way easier. Just the way you had to do it. <laughs> now you have to find the hidden thing. Yep, should have been able to see that switch that I still can't see. And, uh. There you go.
So we found something good to steal, which is the whole reason we broke into the palace. Now we got a GTFO, which is where we're going to run into Balthier and Fraun, I believe, and we get attacked. Actually, the attack might be on the, uh, during the video. Now we have Balthier and Fraun. Access to head here instead of head guard. Okay. Whatever. Uh, I'm not even gonna put jobs on them for now. Yeah, I know. If we get caught, we're stuck. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's super easy. We've got an OP weapon. And that's pretty much all we need. But we now have access to the gambit system. Oh, he's got three different gambits. We never had that before. That's kind of cool. Like at the very top, it says gambit one, two, and three. I think we can have three default sets of gambits, which is awesome. Because I usually end up switching them a lot. And then have a few off and a few on. And I just turn them back and forth. But, Fron should start with cure and fire, I believe. Is there really no way? I thought for sure we'd be able to uh, skip this. So basically it goes order of priority from top to bottom of what's going to happen. If you can do the, the first one, you're not going to do anything else. So it's like programming if, then, less, whatever. system here we go okay I don't like po uh, foe party leader target because what if your target or your party leader is not targeting anything let's just see yeah you can do that that's cool for some reason they're all the same for now but whatever um let me see something here She doesn't have cure. She oh, she does. Okay. Um, ally less than seventy percent. You cure. Um, I'm not gonna do first aid. There's a way to delete it. Yeah, there we go. So you can get more gambits through the license board. Now that we've unlocked gambits, we'll see that our license board has changed a little, and we have more on this side where it's mostly gambits. Slots. We'll need gambit, uh, gambit slots later, but for now we're fine. This is what this map is now, from now on, and uh, monsters will change. Uh, once we leave here, they'll be really strong monsters. Oh my god, can you come back, please? Jeez. I just didn't realize he'd run so far away. Um, the monster not long. These chests 
are still kind of ground. Yeah. And we'll be uh, we'll be running into our first and second boss coming up, I think. Maybe I'm thinking of the hunt. Maybe it's only one boss up here. Yeah. I actually don't remember this map too, too well. Very few times I'm around here. Okay, did we just come from there? Yeah, we did. Light woven shirts actually probably better for one of these two. Uh, but I doubt they can wear it right now. Oh, it's not even that. It's the same as what they're wearing. Um, but they lose a bit of health and gain some magic. And I thought it was a better one. Ha! Yeah. Uh, later when we come in, we can play with the water level and stuff to access certain areas we can't access now. We'll come back here a lot later, though. Yeah, I know. <laughs> it works with every save. We still haven't run into any of the uh, hard fights yet. I don't think this this fight that we're running into now is hard either. It's uh, we're saving <laughs> Lady Ash. Yeah. Oh, I don't know what she calls herself. She gives us a fake name at first. Uh, as a guest. Oh, she's not even technically a guest on our team yet. Oh, maybe. This Amalia, right. So her first name is Amalia, but uh, she's the princess of Dalmasca. And here's our first boss fight. I wasn't sure if this was a fight or if it was a hunt. There's another hunt that we did. Oh, right. This is just another fight. Different hunts. It's not a good boss fight. It's just one of those. It's just plans. Okay, so I guess our only fight's the nightmare. a bunch when we were down here. I don't know if it's because of the water or what. Silken shirt. That's probably a bit better than the last thing we had. Um, see what I mean about it saying guest and it's locked and you can't do anything. That's what Penella was supposed to be. I don't know why they changed that. Okay, so the silken shirt's a bit better. But whatever. Oh, there's two. I assume there wouldn't be one if there we had just gone. Yeah. Ha!
Yeah, I don't know. Some some maps have static on them. I can hear it. It's like the water sound adds the static. So this is a nightmare. This fire main, he's kind of a pain um, with this bushfire. But he's getting really his health choked. He usually only does his bushfire after half health. But he's totally smoked. And done. We could have done our trial mode stuff with Ash as well, but I can't control her, so it's easier for me. Uh, we were just going to be pulled to the Dreadnought, I think, one of the flying ships, and heard about the uh, the main villain, but whatever. Wow, there's a lot of cutscenes in a row there. Now we're back to just being Vaughn, and we're in the prison. We don't have our items. Um, I don't remember if there's any good items in here. Prison's another one of the um, areas you avoid picking up items because of um, the Zodiac Sphere. But that's not a thing in, um, in the Zodiac Age, so you can still pick up all the items. Not that with all our items that we can get, I'd care about one Zodiac Spear. Out of Rust is, uh, it's an item that just does, like, some, a little bit of damage. I can't remember what element it mimics. Did that turn off my speed up booster? Um, I think the Not of Rust is one of those items where it's just, like, showing you, hey, you could have been wearing the diamond armor to get something different, but I don't even think any of these items are super good, and I don't think we have any items to wear at the moment. Huh. And here's the melee fight, which oh, should oh. be over really soon. Yeah. We're on our level. Huh. Um, normally, in um, the regular game, I would usually use magic, just because I wouldn't be so over leveled. But I figured why not. And I can't use magic in this version. Because I don't have a magic class. Why did I do that? Oh, it still gives us that warning. Yeah, I guess there's still one more big boss before the end of this. Technically, yeah, we're still stuck until we get out. <laughs> Excuse me. And 
here we uh we find Bosch, the last uh member of our team. We also I think I don't remember for sure. That was also the Judge Gerbronth, who's actually Bosch's twin brother. Um Bosch defended Delmasca because the same thing that happened to, to Delmasca happened to his um, kingdom. I don't think he was like a noble or anything. I think, oh, really? They can spawn another chest with like 700 kill in it too. Uh, I'm just gonna hit this just in case. So we might need to learn that the lights aren't working. So we've lost Lady Osh, and we have Osh now. Why do I remember his name? Oh, I thought I could buy one. Yeah, I can. Okay. So you can buy a little better stuff. Like, now we can buy the long sword. You don't start with self. Like, not all of these, but just like the actual self one. I wish there was a buy all option. This is like not even half the game bits either. his armor and magic defense by a bit and his strength which will help for damage not that we need any help on damage that's just telling us that mimics can steal uh, charge yeah. the lower the charge the darker it gets in here and the darker it gets I think after like 50% or less you start spawning things that you can't spawn during the um ha. During the light cycle, I guess. And it's all to do with managing the mimic's charge. Every time you kill a mimic who's draining, they will give the rest of their charge to the wall, which oftentimes is more than what they took. And you can only go to 100%. Can't recharge it. There's a good section here later if you wanted to farm, you could farm. Ha! Yeah. We'll be doing it because it's not really efficient farming. Uh, it's an all right amount of farming, 
if you uh, don't want to do Dusty, I would say it'll get you between from like early game up no levels to um, I'd say you can probably do it to like 12. Yeah. 15. It's not super effective. Right. They drop uh, decent sellables, not as good as uh, what Dustia does for sure. They're a bit, oh, uh, a bit better than Wolves, uh, yeah. um, money-wise, but they're 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 subpar, I guess. I don't know. I wouldn't yeah. it anymore. It was something I did when I first started the game. those like chest style mimics in these chests around here. Uh, this is the first area you can find them. They're usually only found in underground areas like this. But we'll run into one soon I'm sure. Yeah. shows what we can access now, but later on we can come back to Farheim Passage. Uh, it's another side quest, but there's like level 50 and 60 stuff we can do here. Uh, it was where I would get a decent set of armor and headgear out of chests. Um, I don't think you can do that anymore. It might be... Uh, <laughs> It's like the mage hat, um, not actually cool mage hat, it's like mage shikari or something. They're yeah. really good. The hat and the armor. They're like heavy armor, but they have um, plus to magic or uh, mana, I can't remember. They're tiered items, actually really high, they're like second or third best armors for heavy armor. Oh, we didn't need to come in here at all. Battle harness. I can't remember exactly what that does. Um, automatically counters with a weapon. Oh, okay. I knew I'd use that before. I just didn't remember how good it was. Um, in this version, we have the ribbon, which is what we'll be having everybody wear once I can uh, get them. I think we need to get to like trial 50 before I can do that, though. start draining when you get a uh, certain distance close. Well, let's go up here first. Hmm. See, now I'm not hearing the static background noise. I bet if I turn the sound effects up. I hear a background noise, but it doesn't sound like static. I don't know. Something weird about this audio. Caramel. Is that an equipment? Like a weapon or something? I don't remember. It doesn't look like a weapon. Okay. Oh, can 
that's down. I think that's a decent one. Was a staff that had a bonus to Earth? Element? No. Okay, it wasn't the one I was thinking of. We have to come back, so I'll grab that uh, chest on the way back. open the gate. So the thing about <laughs> managing your light levels, if you let the mimic drain enough, or you're trying to run through, you can run through certain sections, but other sections you have to be really fast or um, kill a mimic. And uh, I only really mess with the light level if I was going to farm at the end of this passage here. I'll, uh, I'll point it out, but where the there's a orange save crystal. I don't know if it's orange yet. It might be only blue because we can't teleport back to it until you do the Barheim passage. Um, before you do the uh, side quest. I'll point it out because when you come back it might not be overly obvious that it was going to turn orange. And uh, you might never go to that screen again when you come back to Barheim passage. Yeah, so we learn here, because Bosch was framed for killing Rex, who was Vaughn's brother. I think we learn here that it was Gibranth, uh, his twin brother that framed him. But yeah, this crystal here, it turns orange for later. But since we haven't gotten the side quest done, and we haven't come back in here, it's a blue one. Alright, we got a few minutes. We'll be able to clear this section, and then the boss, I think, will end the video dare. And then maybe I'll, uh, oh, okay. Then, so I was Mimic C, just because I know this game. There's at least two more Mimics around here. <laughs> but this is the section here where I would let the light level go down and I'd have the skeletons. And then there's only skeletons here after you clear out these mimics. Yes! So you can just come here. You can get the mimics to draw power enough to lower the light level. Yes! And they're a decent farming. Yes! I did it for a bunch of farming at the time. And I didn't mind it. Yeah. You can get your combo built up and stuff, or your chain level. Lightning Fang's another one of those temporary items where you can cast a spell. I think it's an offensive spell. Yes! Ha! Three 
swamped it and it was at 93% when we finished and we're exited I can't skip this uh, Barheim passage so we're out of jail to think Dalmask and air could taste so sweet so where are we lose Bosch the well. Estes sand by the look of it let's back to Rabanasta before we well. shrivel up by your leave, Captain. Yes, the hour of my return is already over late. The people may hate me, but that does not free me of my charge. And that's where we are. There should be a safe crystal here, though. Oh, I guess we have to get back to Reverend Master to, uh, to lose the captain. Alright, guys. Thanks for watching. I hope you guys join me in the next one. Bye.